My brother Jared Little was a loving, caring man. Jared Little was struck by a tractor trailer on Tuesday while riding his e-bike in East New York at this intersection of Linden Boulevard and Pennsylvania Avenue. What would happen had we had a person there? A traffic person. Council member Charles Barron is calling on Equitable Street Design for this intersection. Equitable because he says his district, 42, is 97% non white, with more than one in four residents living below the poverty line, leaving his constituents, he claims, underserved without the proper signage, pedestrian plazas, bike lanes, and other life saving improvements. We try to avoid this corner as much as we can. Council member Barron says the narrow lanes leave for unsafe conditions. Linden Boulevard has 11 lanes and Pennsylvania Avenue has seven. With the ability to accommodate that many cars on the road, cyclists say the dangers of these corners are well known. The Department of Transportation telling PIX11 News in a statement, every loss of life on our streets is a preventable tragedy. This administration has invested a historic $900 million toward redesigning our streets to support safe transit and bike infrastructure and additional pedestrian space, all with an explicit equity focus to ensure we are delivering this life-saving work to all corners of the city. While they wait for change, Jared's family is asking for help. We all love him and miss him dearly. And we just want to ask you to pray for us and keep us in your, your mind, heart, and spirits. And we're going to try to get through this. And Council Member Barron says that they cannot wait for a years long study by DOT and that improvements need to be expedited to prevent more deaths from happening in this community. In East New York, Michelle Ross, PIX11 News.